Hi, everyone, and a very good afternoon. Thanks so much for joining us today. My name is Sandy Elson, and on behalf of the Travel Professional Community and TravelProfessionalNews.com, I want to welcome all of you to today's webinar, and thank you for taking time out of your busy day to join us. Our host today is Emerald Waterways, which is part of the Scenic Group. Linda Grinnickley joined Emerald Waterways as Business Development Manager for the Southeast Region in September 2015. Her territory includes Alabama, Florida, Georgia, South Carolina, and Mississippi. Linda is an industry veteran, having begun her career in 1980 with Eastern Airlines, the late great Eastern Airlines, and employed in a variety of positions for ocean cruise lines for 26 years. While her travels have taken her to many wonderful destinations over the years, Linda says that nothing tops a European river cruise, which combines the very best that Europe's historic cities and villages have to offer with the easy, laid-back pace of cruising along the world's most famous rivers in style. Linda's topic today is what's new for 2019 at Emerald Waterways, Europe's rivers. Before we get started, please remember that you are all muted, but we welcome your questions. You can type in your questions at any time in the question area you see on the right-hand panel of your screen. At the end of Liz Linda's presentation, we'll get to as many questions as we can. So let's get to all this exciting information about Emerald's plans for 2019. Welcome, Linda. Well, thank you, Sandy. Hello, everyone. Uh, Sandy, I'd like to commend you on the correct pronunciation of my last name. I think you may be the first person that's gotten it right <laughs> in my career. Well, thank I you. I realize Grinnickly is not the easiest name to pronounce. Believe it or not, after 18 years of marriage, my husband claims I still don't pronounce it correctly. So I actually go by Linda G for everyone in the audience. After all, if Kenny G can do it, so can I. Today, I'll be providing you with an overview of Emerald Waterways and what you have to look forward to in 2019. So as I go through this presentation, I hope that you'll truly discover some really unique selling features, as well as points of differentiation that you can use to introduce your clients to Emerald Waterways. So who is the Scenic Group and who is Emerald? Well, if you're not familiar with the company, our parent company is Phoenix Tours, which is a private family-owned company based in Australia that's got its start operating luxury land tours. And we've been in operation for 32 years. In 2008, we introduced Phoenix Luxury Cruises, which is our five-star, all-inclusive, leave-your-wallet-at-home, completely luxurious river cruise line. In 2014, our owner wanted to expand and he introduced Emerald Waterways as a value proposition to Scenic. Now, when I say value proposition, please don't think low end. That's not the case at all. We actually do offer a four-star deluxe river cruise experience. And I think as we go through the presentation, you'll find that for the majority of your clients, you will probably see that they will very likely be full, uh, feel that this is a fully inclusive river cruise experience for their needs. And of course, I'd be remiss if I didn't mention our wonderful new ship, the Scenic Eclipse, the first luxury discovery yacht. She will be due out in August, and she's going to offer some wonderfully exciting and off-the-beaten track itineraries. She is going to be completely all-inclusive. She'll have nine restaurant options, 10 if you include room service, and that is for a maximum of 228 guests. Now, we're also going to have some wonderful optional excursions available. We will have two helicopters on board, as well as a seven-seat submarine. So just in case your client's yacht doesn't have all of the toys, you can book them on a scenic eclipse ocean cruise. Now, of course, today our focus is on emeralds and the river cruises. So why are we talking about river cruises? Well, as you all know, river cruising still is one of the fastest growing segments of the travel industry. It offers a great, cozy, intimate experience, and you have the opportunity on an emerald ship to actually interact with no more than 182 guests, and in many cases, considerably less. And of course, as we know, the ships dock in the part of these wonderful small towns and the fairy tale villages. So our guests can disembark the ship very, very quickly. This is important because it allows your client 
the ability to maximize the amount of time that they actually spend in port. And they have um, the opportunity to, to immerse themselves in the local culture. And after all, isn't that really one of the biggest reasons we all travel? Now, why should you be recommending Emerald Waterways to your clients? Well, we have won a number of prestigious awards. In 2014, our first year in operation, we won the Cruise Critic Editor's Pick Award for the Best New River Ship. And most importantly, for the last three years, we've won the Cruise Critic Editor's Pick Award for the Best River Cruise Line for Value. And that's a huge accolade because it doesn't, it, it takes into consideration the price that your clients pay, but also what's included in that price. So let's look at some of the reasons why we've earned that award for the last three years. Our ships are referred to as star ships. They're very light, they're very bright and contemporary, and they have wonderful innovative features that are not found on other river cruise ships. Five of our ships are identical, and those would be the, star, the Sun, Dawn, Star, and Sky, two of which were built in 14, two in 15, and the Emerald Destiny, which was built in 2017. Now, these are all identical, again, and they operate on the Rhine, Mine, and Danube. We also introduced the Radiance, which is our ship on the Douro just last year in 2017, as well as the Emerald Liberté in 2017, operating in southern France. Now, I leave those two ships aside for a moment because they are a little bit different in terms of the amenities on board, and I'll address that as we go along. The thing to keep in mind with, with river ships, we all operate ships that are essentially the same size. We all have to pass through the same locks and we have to go under the same bridges. So the difference is in what you choose to do with the space. So we make all of our staterooms a little bit larger, not just the upper categories, and we add more public space for amenities. So our ships carry 182 passengers in 92 staterooms. And I know many of you haven't had an opportunity to experience Emerald Waterways, so I am going to attempt to show you a video. I have been advised that this may or may not work, so Sandy will give me an update, but I do hope you'll have an opportunity to see what our guests experience on an Emerald Waterways river cruise. So let's try this. There we go. Buckingham is unique, affordable, and leisurely estate with a difference, and have led to us being awarded Best River Cruise Line for Value by Cruise Critic. Our deluxe fleet of revolutionary starships promise contemporary comfort and unique onboard innovation, while our generous, fully inclusive offering combines affordability with great dining, exceptional service, and immersive itineraries across Europe. We take great pride in ensuring every journey is perfectly planned, and each guest enjoys a relaxing, exciting, and insightful river cruise experience. Whether you're staying aboard our award-winning fleet or exploring a nearby town for the day, we cruise the Rhine, Maine, Danube, Moselle, Son, Rhone, and Douro rivers, with journeys ranging from eight to seventeen days. Once integral trade and transportation routes. And now gateways to cultural enlightenment. And there's no final way to navigate these treasured landmarks and on board Europe's newest fleet of river cruise ships. From the many UNESCO World Heritage Sites, Fairy Tale Castles, and grandiose cathedrals in mainland Europe, to France's laid back rural southern region where a deeply way of life dominates the water's edge. With so much included, it's what we like to call exceptional emerald values. Excellent. I hope that worked for you, Sandy. Thank you for the update. You're now, welcome. I hope I've, I hope I've piqued your curiosity to learn a bit more. So now we'll look at some of the reasons why Emerald Waterways has been awarded the best river cruise line for value, again, for the last three years. We do provide transfers. Uh, to and from the airport and the ship. Now, this is whether your clients purchase air from us or not. So that's a big point of differentiation. If your clients do air on their own, we have parameters in place regarding the arrival and departure dates and times, and our reservations department can give you specific details. 
We also do provide complimentary unlimited beer, wine, and soft drinks at lunch and dinner. And if your clients would like, they can purchase an onboard beverage package to create an all-inclusive experience. We have many different packages available, again, for purchase on board. We do include a shore excursion virtually every day of the cruise. And again, remember our background as a luxury tour operator. We realize that the shore portion of the experience is every bit as important as the shipboard experience. So we put a very heavy emphasis on the content of our shore excursions. We include gratuities. This is a huge point of differentiation. Many of our competitors do not. Gratuities are included, not just on board the ship, but on those included shore tours as well. Now, we do have bicycles on board all of our ships, except for the Radiance on the Duro. And throughout the presentation, I'll try to give you a few tips and tricks. I know we're not the only river cruise line that you're working with, although I'd like to think that might change as to this presentation. But a tip and trick, the Duro River starts with the letter D, so does different. So the radiance on the Duro River, because of limitations and the size of the ship, is a little bit different. So if you're selling the radiance on the Duro River, just double check your facts. So again, there are no bicycles on the ship, the radiance on the Duro, and essentially that's because there are no safe biking trails alongside of the river. Plus, we do have our complimentary listening devices, and we do include Emerald Plus. Now, Emerald Plus are actually extra special um, activities and events that are designed to give your clients more of a cultural immersion experience. So we'll look at some of those in just a moment, the actual events. And we do include Emerald Active, guided and self-guided hiking and biking tours, as well as a River Cruise Guarantee. So let's look at the River Cruise Guarantee. Uh, fairly recently, we introduced a complimentary River Cruise Guarantee. While it's not meant to replace travel insurance, it does give your clients not only peace of mind, but most importantly, prorated monetary compensation in the form of refunds for delays and cancellations that are due to either high or low water, a natural disaster, a strike, or a mechanical breakdown. So you can get additional information on this guarantee on our website. And once again, it is included it is not meant to replace travel insurance. So let's look at the onboard experience. I, I, one thing I hear most frequently from my agents is from the minute their clients step aboard, the, the warmth and the, serve, the attention to detail of our service personnel is exemplary. So I think that you'll find that the service on board is going to exceed your client's expectations for, sur for sure. <clears throat> Excuse me. Now, I do want to point out that behind this mirrored wall in our reception area, there is an elevator bank, and it does service all three passenger decks. We have a main atrium, which is um, a beautiful three-deck and 24-foot-high section of the ship, which adds to the lightness, brightness, and airiness. We do have one main restaurant, which is large enough to accommodate all of our guests at one time. We have tables for two, four, six, and eight. So your clients can dine with whomever they choose. They can have a table for two one night. If they meet new friends and they'd like to dine with them another night, they can do so. And if it turns out those new friends aren't quite as much fun as they had hoped, they can go right back to that table for two. Now, during lunch and breakfast, we do have uh, buffets as well as some a la carte selections. At breakfast, we do have an egg chef to cook eggs to order. And at lunch, we have a food action station as well as regional specialties. Now, our dinners are four courses, and um, we do have, if we have a city where we overnight, such as Vienna, we actually serve a buffet dinner so that our guests can go ashore to experience a classical concert. The Horizon Bar and Lounge is actually a great place to meet new friends. In the evening, we have a DJ, we have a pianist that perform in the evening. And we also offer a daily English tea in this area each afternoon. Now, one of the most innovative features aboard our ships, and I hope you did see it in the video in action, but it, this is our indoor swimming pool and lounge area. Many river cruise ships do not have a swimming 
school. And when they do, it's typically located on the top sun deck. So they're heated, but they're exposed to the elements. So featured on all of our ships, with the exception of the radio radiance on the Doro, because remember, she's different, our pool is actually located on the top passenger deck at the rear or aft section, and it's a beautiful infinity pool. It's heated and it has a current, and it also has a retractable roof. So if the weather's accommodating, we can open it to the sun. And we take this innovative idea one step further. Several nights during the cruise, we actually raise the bottom of the pool deck up. It becomes level with the surrounding deck. The water is trapped underneath. We squeegee it down, put in some comfortable chairs, and we turn it into a movie theater. Now, this picture, um, it doesn't give you the full effect, but these, this space actually accommodates 30 or so guests seated. And other evenings, we'll use this for broadcasts and sporting events, etc. So if you have groups, we do. You have meeting space. We can use this area for cocktail parties. However, we do have to work around the standard onboard programming. Now here you'll see a pool on the top deck, so we know automatically this isn't our standard ship. This is the Radiance on the Doro. So it's a serenity pool located on the sun deck. It is heated, but it will not convert to the movie theater. Excuse me. Uh, if your clients like to dine al fresco, they can grab a light breakfast or a lunch from the Horizon Bar Buffet, which is just on the other side of those glass windows. They can take their selection out to the terrace. And this area has windscreens for when the ship is sailing. It's roofed and it has heaters. So if the weather's cooler, our guests will still be quite comfortable. And this area is going to be smaller on the Liberté and the Radium. Here you'll see our sun deck. So our guests can enjoy the wonderful scenery while they relax in a deck chair, and we have both covered and uncovered tables and chairs as well. Or they can play a game of tic-tac-toe in our large games area. They can brush up on their golf game. We do have a three-hole putting green. I don't think they have to be true golf aficionados. Every time I see someone in that area, they seem to have a golf club in one hand and a glass of beer or wine in the other. So it's very much a social activity. And we do have a walking track as well. Also, if weather permits, we often have a barbecue buffet for our guests to enjoy during one of their cruises. And that really is a highlight, to see the wonderful scenery and be able to enjoy a wonderfully varied barbecue buffet. Now, we market in English-speaking countries where we have offices. That means the UK, Canada, and Australia, as well as the US. And we tend to have a more active, younger demographic passenger on board uh, typically in the mid-50s. Now, do we have our more mature guests as well? Absolutely, but we are bringing down that average age a bit. We have a wonderful wellness and spa area. We have a beauty salon for manis and petties. We also have a spa on board. Now, these are considered items of a personal nature, and therefore, they do have an additional cost. Our wellness area also features a fitness room, so guests don't have to give out their fitness routine. And we have towels and water, the TV, fans to ensure our guests' comfort. There's also typically three to four pieces of equipment, such as bikes, treadmills, rowing machines, and free weights. And again, that fitness area is complimentary. We do bring on local entertainment several nights during the cruise, depending on the itinerary. And I mentioned Emerald Plus, just to, re to recap, um, they are those extra special events and activities, again, designed to give your clients more of a cultural immersion experience, but again, included in the price of the cruise. So here you'll see some of the types of activities offered. The number varies depending on the itinerary. So we do list the events in our brochure. So it could be something as lighthearted as a German Umba band, as entertainment one evening, to a hosted afternoon tea with a local Slovakian family. So I'm not going to go into all of these. They will vary by itinerary, but I think you'll agree there is quite a diverse uh, variety of offerings. One thing is definitely clear. Our guests love these extra special events and the opportunities to interact with the locals because they have the opportunity to learn more about their culture and their customs. And so it's a highlight for those who want to do more than just scratch the surface of the area that they're visiting. Again included is Emerald Active. Here you'll see a few of a few samples 
but essentially these are guided and self-guided hiking and biking tours, again with the exception of the Dura, we do have 15 bicycles on board our ship. And these activities are designed for those who have a, a little more active lifestyle. The activities are dependent on the weather, and um, there is a minimum level of physical fitness required. Uh, we do have those grouped on intensity levels. And this year, we'll be expanding our active experiences to include yoga on the Radiance on the Douro, as well as canoeing on a tributary of the Douro River in Portugal. Now, do we have shore tours for which your clients can choose to participate and pay extra? The answer to that is yes. Discover more are our optional excursions that are, again, designed to enhance the experience and offer some unique insight into the region. I suggest these for clients who may have been to a port or a city that we're visiting on a previous visit because this gets them out and a bit further afield so that they can explore more of the surrounding region. So you can take a classical concert in Vienna or you can go to a city such as Salzburg or one of my favorites, Chesky Kromlov in the Czech Republic. So I don't know if you're familiar with Chesky Kromlov. It is depicted in the photo there. One of my favorite places. Um, one, another tip and trick, if your clients discover more, they are going to pay a little more. However, these short tours, the optionals, are extremely reasonably priced. Emerald Waterways offers a variety of accommodations to meet your clients' needs. And as I mentioned earlier, our staterooms are larger than the industry average. So here you see our owner's one-bedroom suite. All suites have underbed storage for luggage. And you can also see our open-air balcony system, which is a feature on all of our starships. Um, this is a wonderful idea, and we'll look at it in a bit more detail in just a moment. We have up to four owner suites on every Emerald Starship. And they do range in size from 285 to 315 square feet. And as you can see, they do have a separate bedroom and living area for those who like to entertain or simply want more space. If you have folks that like to dine with the captain, book them in the owner suite. That is an automatic invitation. And as you can see, this suite actually does have a number of upgraded amenities, including that Nespresso coffee machine, um, the free mini bar stocked daily. All staterooms do have a mini bar, but only in the two upper categories are the contents complementary. And here you'll see a grand balcony suite. This is our second largest accommodation on board. And we have up to eight of these staterooms on board each starship, ranging in size from 207 to 210 square feet. Again, you get a few extra items, such as laundry service. Again, this is in the upper categories only. And these suites also have our open-air balcony system, along with glass doors that will close off the balcony from the rest of the room. Here you'll see our panorama balcony suite. The majority of our suites are actually in this category, and they range from 160 to 180 square feet. And the balcony area is incorporated into the stateroom. It is delineated by a teak deck. It has two chairs and a table. And here you'll see that wonderfully innovative open-air balcony system. And this is a design idea that we did steal from our sister company, Phoenix. It features floor-to-ceiling, wall-to-wall windows. At the touch of a button, that window actually drops down, allowing your guests to regulate the amount of fresh air and sunshine they prefer. So if the weather's cooler or rainy, they can still use their balcony as a sunroom. They're not paying for real estate they may or may not be able to use. Here you'll see a photo of our entry-level suite located on the bottom or Riviera deck. They are larger than the industry average, ranging from 153 to 170 square feet versus some of our competitors at 135 square feet. So that's a tremendous noticeable difference. They do feature a fixed window, and, but again, very light, bright, and airy. And we also offer two single occupancy staterooms in this category that are equipped with a twin size bed. They are a little bit smaller, ranging from 105 to 117 square feet, with the exception of the radiance on the Duro. She does not have the single occupancy stateroom. Next, we'll look at some of the itineraries we offer. 
We sail predominantly on the Rhine, Main, and Danube, although we also offer the Moselle, as well as southern France on the Rhone and the Seine, and the Douro River. Now, here are some of our more popular itineraries. So note that the majority are eight days in length, although we do offer longer cruises like the nine-day Budapest to Bucharest, as well as the 15-day Splendors of Europe between Amsterdam and Budapest. And some of our itineraries can be combined to create longer sailings, such as combining our, uh, our Secrets of the Douro eight-day with our Southern France to create a 15-day itinerary between Porto and Arles um, and creating thereby a multi-country experience. I want you folks to remember our Sensations of Southern France itinerary. This is an amazing itinerary between Lyon and Arles. We introduced it last spring with the Esmo Liberté, 138 guests. This is an amazing itinerary for your foodies, for your, uh, your wine aficionados, for folks that enjoy chocolate and history. One of the highlights of this cruise is a, we actually bring on a Provencal chef. Chef Fabian, he is absolutely amazing, and he prepares an authentic Provencal, Provencal meal on board that's absolutely mouth-watering. On the Douro, please note that we own and operate our ship, the Radio, so we have complete autonomy over the crew and the itinerary. She carries 112 guests and operates an eight-day round-trip Porto. And again, as I mentioned, or I didn't mention, we do own and, op and, and operate our own docking facilities in Porto as well. So we have the best position located right in the heart of the uh, historic Porto. Now, we did introduce a Charms of Holland and Belgium itinerary in 2018. It's an eight day with departures in July and September of this year, but also May and October in 2019. Uh, please note that on the latter departures, of course, the tulips will not be blooming, but it's a great opportunity for your clients to experience this wonderful itinerary at a time when other companies simply aren't offering it. Also new in 2018 was the Majestic Rhine. We added a few new itineraries of the Rhine, but this is a wonderful opportunity. It's eight days between Basel and Frankfurt. Um, actually, you would fly into Frankfurt, the, the ship would, you would meet the ship in Mainz. Um, and this includes the canal cruise in Strasbourg. We are offering July and through September of 2018 and July and August in 2019. Brand new to Emerald Waterways for 2019 is our wonderful Lower Danube. And that actually, I think it marries the best of the East and the West because you create a wonderful itinerary between Vienna and Belgrade. And you have calls in Budapest, Croatia, and other wonderful cities. There are going to be two dates on this itinerary in August of 2019. And this itinerary is perfect for your well-traveled guests, as it visits many towns that are off the beaten tourist path. Another new itinerary for 2019 is our classic Danube. This is an eight-day. And your clients on this itinerary are actually going to have time to enjoy the highlights because we do spend extra time in your arrival and departure cities of Nuremberg and Vienna and overnight, in fact. So these cruises will depart in July and August of 2019 and will feature a total of six shore excursions, three Emerald Plus activities, uh, including a visit to St. Stephen's Cathedral in Passau and that's a beautiful example of Baroque architecture with Europe's largest pipe organ with more than 17,000 pipes. Uh, and your clients will actually enjoy an organ concert while they're there. I am very excited to announce that for 2019, Emerald Waterways has chartered a brand new yacht, the MV Adriatic Princess. And this will offer a unique way for your clients to see the Dalmatian coastline off Croatia. So this ship actually has 18 cabins for a maximum of 36 guests. Um, I would encourage you, if you have a group of friends that are interested in traveling together, reach out to us for charter opportunities. 18 cabins would charter this particular vessel. 
Now, do note that this is going to be a slightly different experience from our river cruises. It is not going to be as inclusive. We will provide two dinners on board, but the assumption is that our guests are going to want to go ashore to experience the nightlife and the restaurants serving their local cuisine. This type of trip is for your travelers that really want to live the yachting lifestyle, to go in and explore and live like a local. We will include um, breakfast, seven breakfasts, six lunches, and we do include two beverages per passenger at lunch and dinner. Gratuities are included as are nine different guided tours. And here you'll see the itinerary. It is an eight day. It does give your guests plenty of time to explore independently. And in fact, this itinerary has been so successful, we've actually added a second chartered yacht, the MV Adriatic Pearl, with seven additional sailings. So this will sell quickly. If you have clients, reach out to your BDM to obtain uh, promotional materials. If you don't have, we are happy to assist you. But what a wonderful opportunity and a great example of the ways Emerald Waterways continues to expand. We will be offering two land extensions. One will be a four day, and you can see the itinerary here. Um, and this is only available as a pre or post cruise. Um, so I'm sorry, this is available for either a pre or post cruise. The next land extension is an eight day only, and it actually can only be done on select dates as a post-cruise extension. One thing I'd like to mention that I don't have on the slide is that with this extension, it is also possible to pick up an eight-day cruise on Emerald Waterways departing from Budapest, and I believe that's on one date only during the month of September. Here's another surprise. Um, we actually are starting to expand with two new itineraries in 2019 to Egypt. Now, as you know, tourists are beginning to return to this area, and it's a great time to visit, to experience the ancient history and culture before it gets too crowded again. So we're seeing tourism numbers come up. We feel it's a great time for your clients to explore this area. We have an exclusive charter on the MS Camille. And if you're not familiar with this ship, she is actually a Mogan Pick ship. She will be renovated for us in 2018. She'll have 142 guests in 72 staterooms. And on this ship as well, we will have two single occupancy staterooms. So please make a note of that. That's great news for all of us. The ship is going to, um, as I said, be renovated. So she's going to be very sleek and modern, but she's still going to have all of the comforts that your clients are going to expect from Emerald Waterways. And as you can see in the photo, we will have a swimming pool on board. Unfortunately, it will not convert to a movie theater. The cabins on this ship are all roughly 244 square feet. And we actually do have uh, four passenger decks as well as the sun deck. So this, this ship is actually five decks high. Now, as far as the itineraries are concerned, we'll offer two different itineraries. One is going to be a 15 day, and you'll see that itinerary here. Now note that the first four days, you're actually going to be exploring the pyramids and the culture of the area. This is land-based. You will fly to Luxor to meet the ship, and then you'll take a four day cruise. After that, you will have two nights in Amman, two nights in Petra, and one night at the Dead Sea. And just in case you're wondering if you're not familiar with this, the flight time between Cairo and Amman is actually approximately two hours. All of your intro, internal flights are going to be included with these options. And the hotels that we will be using are four and five star hotels for the land portion. Now, we also offer a 10-day option. It is essentially the same without the Jordan segment, as you can see. So it is a 10-day cruise. Again, your internal flights uh, to and from Cairo will be included as well.
as far as the inclusions on the Egypt Nile River and our Jordan itineraries, as I mentioned, it, all of the itineraries will begin with a three-night stay in Cairo at the beginning of the tour. You are going to have, in both cases, a four-night sailing on board the MS Hamiz. Selected meals are included, but all meals on board the ship are included. Selected meals refer simply to the land portion. We will provide two drinks per guest at lunch and dinner on board the vessel. You will have the included shore excursions as well as Emerald Plus options. We do have onboard entertainment. I've mentioned a couple of times the internal flights. We do provide the airport transfers to and from your ship and the hotel, as well as your port charges and all tipping and gratuities. Now, for Asia, we currently offer sailings on the Mekong River that is on board the Mekong Navigator, which is a very nice upscale ship. These ships in Asia tend to be a little bit smaller. The Mekong Navigator holds 68 guests. But new for 2019, we're going to be introducing the Irrawaddy. So we will offer a 17-day Magic of the Irrawaddy and Discoverer, Discoverer Cruise. And that is on a ship, the RV Irrawaddy Explorer. And she's a nice ship as well. She's a bit smaller in that she only accommodates 56 guests. Now, I can tell you, I've just come back from the Mekong re region, and it was absolutely um, a unique experience. The food, the culture, the people could not be friendlier. If any of you have specific questions regarding the Mekong specifically, and of course the Irrawaddy as well, I'm happy to address those questions later. Um, another new itinerary for 2019, Russia. Now, I, this is a new for us. We are actually going to be using the MS Rosia. She will operate on the Volga River between St. Petersburg and Moscow. And this is going to be a 12-day itinerary. Now, one thing I would ask you to keep in mind, this is not going to be a an emerald starship atmosphere on board. This is actually going to be a traditional Russian River cruise ship experience. So it's not going to have all of the amenities. It certainly doesn't have a swimming pool that converts to a movie theater, but all of the transfers are included. You do have a selection of drinks to accompany your meals. Shore tours are going to be included, gratuities, of course, and we are going to include the river cruise guarantee on our Russian destinations. I do want to spend a moment to talk about groups. I hope between all of the new itineraries as well as our existing itineraries that you have some thoughts about folks that you know in your database or new clients you'd like to bring in that might have interest in traveling to some of these destinations. So with us, of course, we want to work with you to grow your group business. I would encourage you to reach out to your BDM. We love to assist you with your sales and promotional efforts. We can help you create flyers. Co-op marketing funds may be available. You'd have to speak with your individual BDM. Again, a reminder, uh, I'm sorry, we do offer one for nine on our tour conductors. So every 10th passenger is free based on double occupancy on a cruise only basis. Something that we've introduced at Emerald, Wa uh, Emerald Waterways is an amenity point program. So at the time you book your group, you will be advised of the number of amenity points that are available on the sailing you've ch chosen. So then you use those points to customize your group's amenities based on your preferences or their preferences. And this is just a guideline. You would receive an official copy with your group proposal. I would encourage you to visit our agent portal at www.emeraldswaterways.com. We do have an online booking engine. We refer to it as Expressbook. We've made some recent changes uh, to protect the security and private information of you and your guests. So we have implemented um, a few new sign-on procedures. Very simple. If you have not signed on in the last month, however, I do encourage you to do so so that you can access your clients' bookings to make changes and to review various uh, items of importance. 
Now, I also hope I've encouraged you to take the time to learn more about Emerald's Waterways. So I'd love for you to go to our Emerald Specialist course. It's a very easy course. Um, after listening to this webinar, you can probably fly through it in maybe 30 to 45 minutes. I hope you'll take the hour or so that it typically takes an agent. But once you've completed the course, you can send your first booking that you make within six months of completing the course to the email address on your certification, and we will mail you a $100 gift card just as a little thank you for taking the time to learn a bit more about Emerald Waterways. If you're not familiar with your BDM, you can also locate that individual on our website. Again, if you're in Georgia, Alabama, Florida, South Carolina, or Mississippi, or if you use a host agency located in one of those cities, then I would be your contact person. If not, I could certainly point you in the right direction. And of course, this is where you'll also get our latest promotions for individuals as well as groups and to order your brochures. Now, I did mention in conjunction with the Dalmatian Coast, our new yacht cruises in the um, Adriatic, that we do have charter opportunities. You can do sole charters or wet lease charters. Your BDM is going to be your contact person. They'll be happy to discuss it with you and provide a proposal. So please reach out to them if you have those opportunities. Our current offer, good for 2019 European River Cruises, we've changed our program in the way that we price our air. So this is very interesting, and I think it'll make it very easy for you to understand. But we do offer air from 25 major gateways under the current promotion, most major cities, but some secondary cities as well. Um, but we are offering fly free on the horizon deck. Now, that's going to be our top passenger deck. Fly from 295, or I'm sorry, fly for 295 on the Vista deck, which is our middle passenger deck. And if they choose the Riviera deck, that's where the Emerald Staterooms reside with the, um, with the picture windows, then the air is 495. So it's either free, 295, or 495, depending upon the category book. Now, this is for bookings made by August 15th of 2018. Again, for 2019 sailings, new bookings only. And if your clients pay in full at time of booking, they can save up to an additional $1,000 per couple. So I think you'll agree that's a pretty rich offer. So I'd like to thank you for taking the time to learn more about Emerald Waterways. I really hope that I've given you the information as well as the points of differentiation that you need to confidently recommend and quote and Emerald Waterways River Cruise. So please remember the distinction of the best river cruise line for value for 2014, 15, and 16. Uh, we do appreciate your support and look forward to working with you. Um, so reach out to your BDM so we can help you grow your river cruise business with Emerald Waterways. And now I'd like to turn the presentation back to Sandy. Thank you so much. Thanks so much, Linda. That was fabulous. Really looks like Emerald is uh... It is just a, a wonderful river cruise line for so many different reasons. Um, we do have several questions. One of them was about um, BDMs, business development managers. If our agents go to the Emerald Waterways website, mm -hmm. is there a list of BDMs and their territories on that website? Yes, there is. Visit um, www.emeraldwaterways. Um, go to the agency portal section. And yes, you can locate your individual BDM. Okay, fabulous. Um, so let's get to some of these questions. Um, the video that you showed, is that available to our agents to show to their clients? Is that on the we website? We can actually get that to you. Um, it is a video. Generally speaking, the best bet is to contact your BDM and they will be able to send it to you. Okay, but yes, great. we encourage you to use it. I think it's a great just under two minutes, it gets the point across very clearly and succinctly. Okay, great. Uh, does Emerald Waterways offer anything in the way of destination wedding assistance? We don't really offer destination wedding um, assistance, unfortunately. Um, what I would suggest, again, that would be a BDM 
um, conversation. We don't have a program in place. What I would suggest is one of my agents contacted me with that type of question. I would really need to know the details. Um, as far as making the arrangements, however, we do not do that for them. Okay. Uh, one of our agents wants to know if there is self-service laundry aboard these river boats and if it is um, complimentary or do you have to pay for it? All right, I'm having a senior blonde moment. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I'll have to get back to you. I'm sorry. I'm drawing a complete blank. See, okay. we have complimentary laundry. It is, com it is complimentary. Um, self-service. If you send it out, there is a charge. On, oh, okay. So I'll need to double check on there. I'm drawing a complete thanks blank. I do apologize. Oh, that's okay. And I can tell you from experience, you don't have to be blonde to have senior moments. <laughs> so <laughs> no worries about that. Um, you talked about the yacht, the Adriatic Princess too. Is there a pool aboard that yacht? On the, on the Adriatic, On the Adriatic Princess? Did I yes. hear you correctly? I yes. That. Yes, mm -hmm. there is. Yes, there okay. is. And um, the uh, the boat that's the yacht that's doing the um, Egypt uh, is that Ham Hamis? What, what was the name the, of that? The, the Hamis. Hamis, right? Uh, uh, the uh, slide said that it was chartered, and our our agent wants to know if that's chartered exclusively to Emerald. Are they all Emerald guests on those sailings? On the Egypt cruises, yes, that is the case on the Hamid. Now, the one case where that is the exception is the Russian itinerary on the Volga River with the Rosea. That is not a complete full charter, so you would be sharing the ship with other guests. Okay. Great, thank you. Um, what is the Everything general? Everything else is a complete Oops. exclusive charter, with the exception of Russia. Okay, great. Well, what is the general demographic of Emerald Waterways guests? Are they mostly Americans? Are they UK and Australia? About what is the demographic? Our demographics on Emerald Waterways are um, college-educated, typically empty nesters. Most frequently, they're extremely well-traveled. They've typically taken ocean cruises or luxury land tours prior to a river cruise experience. Our, our guests range in age, my goodness, from the 40s up until the 70s. Um, typically, we've been coming in at about 55 years of age on average. Now, keep in mind, when we started operating Emerald Waterways in 2014, we already had a presence in North America and in the U.S. specifically with Scenic. So when Emerald was launched in 2014, we actually ran from the inception about 25% of our guests from the U.S., the same number from Canada, the U.K., and Great Britain. So we are split very equally. Now, every sailing is going to be a little bit different. There's no way to predict exactly the percentages. Um, but we find that on average, it averages out to about 25% on any given sailing. Now, I would also like to point out, if any of you have ever traveled with Aussies before, you know that they can add to the um, entertainment in the evening. And so we do tend to have a little more fun, a little more activity in the evening than some river cruise ships. So, again, each sailing is going to be a bit different, but if your clients are, are concerned that it may be too quiet in the evenings for them, they might find Emerald's Waterways would be a great option, especially with the pool where we show those first run and classic movies in the evening, and we do use that area for other entertainment options as well. Okay, fantastic. Uh, we have time for a couple of more questions. I want to let our agents know that if we don't get to your question, or if you think of something after the webinar is over, Linda has put up her phone number there, her email address, and of course the Emerald Waterways website. So get in touch with Linda and she will point you in the right direction. Um, Linda, yes, and I would like to point out, um, I'm sorry, Sandy, I no, no, want to point out the phone, the phone number that you see up there is the Emerald Waterways reservations line, because they can assist you with general questions. Okay, excellent. Thank you for clarifying that. Um, is the uh, deposit 
that uh, clients pay refundable? And is there any kind of incentive to pay the final payment earlier? Is there any kind of discount for paying it earlier than final payment date? Sure, great question. Okay, first of all, our deposits are non-refundable. On Emerald, they are $500 per person. They are due typically within 48 hours of making the booking. Now, we have introduced a deposit protection plan. This is the, it, it must be purchased at the time the reservation is booked. The cost is $125 per person. It is not to provide a refund of their deposit. What we will enable them to do is to take the balance, because the price is $125, um, they would transfer their deposit to a future sailing that has to be booked within 24 months of the date of cancellation. So it's not going to refund their deposit, but it will enable them to transfer it to another sailing. So that was part one. Part two, is there a discount for paying early? Well, yes, um, if you remember in that last slide, I'll put it back up here for just a moment, if I can. Um, we do have our current promotion in conjunction with our free air. Um, and if the clients pay in full at time of booking, and actually if they pay in full by August 31st, we want to encourage them to pay in full at the time of booking, then you're done with this. You don't have to worry about going back to them. Um, but if they pay in full at the time of booking, they could receive up to an additional $1,000 per couple. And the amount depends on exactly what it is they're purchasing. And this is on the European River Cruise. Okay, excellent. And our last question, many of our agents would like to know how they can experience Emerald as far as travel agent rates or FAM trips. Okay. The first step. In order to have access, and thank you so much, folks. I'm really glad that you're interested in experiencing Emerald Waterways. Uh, that means I may have done my job here today. <laughs> in any event, <laughs> in any event, one of the prerequisites, you must be an Emerald Waterways specialist before you can have access to the rate. So go online and complete that course. Then you need to reach out to your BDM because your BDM will want to discuss your marketing plan, how you plan to promote Emerald Waterways upon your return. We need to get a feeling um, for exactly the reasons you wish to experience this. We want agents to see exactly what it is we have to offer. You will sell us with utmost confidence if you, if you have experienced us, um, but it is up to the discretion of the BDM. There is an application process, and they will complete the application for you before submitting it for consideration. So number one, become an Emerald Specialist. Number two, reach out to your BDM. Fabulous. Well, you did indeed do a great job, a wonderful job, and we appreciate it. I want to thank our host today, Emerald Waterways, and our wonderful speaker, Linda Grinickley, Business Development Manager for the Southeast Region. Linda, thank you so much. I think everyone learned a whole lot about Emerald that we didn't know before. Wonderful. Thank you so much for the opportunity. I truly appreciate it, Sandy, and thank you to everybody that tuned in. And I look I'll forward to hearing you. from you. I'll add my thanks to everyone who's uh, live on this webinar. We appreciate your being here, and I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. See you next time. Bye, everybody.